tell about a roach named Rube with a high tech shell. Caught in the trap late one night. He got away fast, but he didn't feel right. Nowhere to hide, so he started to run. Instead of a swat, he got a chip on his butt. He's the roach with the most. Ruffle roach. He don't like the boast. Ruffle roach. Unlike his brother Reggie. He's got all the edge. Ruffle roach and red. on top of Slug Mountain. Uh, can't breathe, heart pounding, head exploding, body falling. I told you this hike would make you feel like a new bug. Must have food. Oh, you really are hungry, aren't you, Reg? You started on the paper plate. Hmm? Hey, don't look at me. Get it away from me! It's a, it's a, uh, what the heck is it? It's adorable, that's what it is. <laughs> Look, Reg, it's giving me a kiss. And sucking on all your precious body fluids. Get rid of it, Rube. Aren't you a lovely little slug mountain creature? Yeah, that's what I'll call you, a sluggy. You're such a pretty little sluggy, aren't you? Oh, and you're a ticklish little sluggy, too! Ah! Look, Reg, a baby sluggy! All I had to do was tickle it! Now you can have one of your very own. Rube, it's sucking my nose off. I knew we should have brought a camera. Aren't they adorable? Get off me, you miserable little... We'll pay you anything. <laughs> adorable thing, you? Yes, adorable, but uh, expensive, I'm afraid. Oh, no, we couldn't take your money. Here, have this sluggy. Oh, thank ah. you. It's adorable. Isn't it adorable? It's adorable. <laughs> What'd you do that for, Rube? We could have made some quick cash. I didn't want to make money, Reg. I'm just happy to find a sluggy a good home. Besides, there's more sluggies right over there. That's it, Rube. Let's grab all the sluggies we can carry and find them all good homes. For a nominal fee, of course. Reg, that's a wonderful idea. I'm so proud of you. Me too. Now pull this sucker off my nose, will you? Come on down to Reg's Pet Emporium and get yourself a Sluggy, the most lovable pet in the world. Instant attachment is guaranteed. Oh, Sluggy number 156, I'm gonna miss you. He's adorable. Ah, <laughs> adorable. Sluggy number 157, I'm gonna miss you. You're so adorable. So oh, adorable. Adorable. Sluggy number 158. The customers get attached to their sluggies and detached from their money, Rube. <laughs> I think this is gonna be our best business venture ever. <laughs> the thing that's so great about this product is that it's self-perpetuating. Whenever we need more sluggies, they're right at our fingertips. Hey, what'd you stop for, Rube? Keep tickling. Sorry, Reg. My tickling muscles were getting a little tired. But, Reg, we already have quite a few. In fact, there's one on your... Ah! Ah! Hurry up, Rube. Get in here. <laughs> they certainly seem to like TV, don't they, Reg? Well, who can blame them? Look who's on. Sluggies! You can do some crazy things with them. You can take them for a walk. Whoa! whoa. You can teach them all sorts of tricks. Okay, Sluggy, sit. 
Roll over. Big. Uh, well, uh, what's this? Okay, Sluggy, reproduce. Diggy, 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 diggy. Whoa! You'll save a fortune on pet food because all they eat is paper. Even the mayor got a Sluggy. I got a Sluggy, and then another, and another, and another. And I made this beautiful Sluggy mayoral chain of office. You gotta get a Sluggy! <laughs> Okay, somebody get these things off me. Somebody! Mm, tonight on VTN News, Sluggy Mania hits Vexburg. Mm. That's it, Rube. No more customers. We've saturated the Sluggy market. I hope you're not disappointed, Red. Are you kidding? We made enough money to retire ten times over. I'm not sure I even want to retire once, Reg. I sort of like being of use to the community. <laughs> of use, he says. Of use. Ah, well, you're going to have to get used to being useless, Rube. Because <laughs> this afternoon, we are going to a tropical island paradise, and we're going to do absolutely nothing for the rest of our natural lives. We're going to do nothing? Absolutely nothing. We've earned it. Let's go. Hello! Ha! Ah, ah, oh, emergency! The sluggies! They're ruining my makeup! Ah, ah. I gotta go, Wrench! The mayor needs help! Oh, all right. I'll take this wheelbarrow of cash home, meet you there, make it snappy, Rube. We got a lifetime of nothing ahead of us. And, uh, be careful on your way out. There you go, Mayor. You're sluggy free. <gasps> River <Root. laughs> These sluggies have become a ticklish, giggling, extremely fertile menace. <laughs> oh, they don't mean any harm, Your Excellentude. It's the police hotline, but <laughs> where is it? <laughs> Mayor, the sluggies are out of control. <laughs> the city's in turmoil. <laughs> You gotta declare, you gotta declare a state of... <laughs> a state of... <laughs> Go! you, Rube, even if I appear to be deceased. Never wake me up! Sorry, Reg, but the sluggies are now tickling each other. That sounds like so much fun. Reg, there's a new sluggy born oh, every 2.2 seconds. Oh, really? Well, I guess they need one of old Reg's obedience lessons because my sluggies are... <laughs> hey, where are my little fellas? Oh, no! <laughs> well, it's because they like eating paper, that's why. There, there, Reg. Why don't you just watch a little television? That usually makes you feel better. <laughs> They've got to be stopped, Rube. <laughs> They're beasts. <laughs> that's what they are, they're little money-eating beasts. Adorable money-eating beasts, Reg. And here they come now. Huh? Boy, they sure do enjoy television, don't they? It's almost like they're hypnotized. That's it. All we need is a giant TV, and then we could hypnotize all of them and drag them out of here for good. Great idea, Reg. But where would we ever get a television that big? 
Wow, that's what I call a TV. citizens of Vexburg are happy, everybody will be happy, as long as there is television. Reg, your plan worked perfectly. Reg? Uh-oh. You gotta get a sluggy. Even the mayor got a sluggy. <laughs> Come on, Reg! This is definitely too much TV for you! 